Heyo, Thalia here, and welcome back to Subnautica, where we have another message on the radio that I did not expect. So, what do this we got here? from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't want us this might happen. Who? Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Um... Come get us already. Grim... Signal location uploaded to Excuse PDA. me. Grim looking snake thing? Would you like to like go over that a little bit more in depth? You know what I'm saying? Like perhaps exploring what in the world that could possibly mean? Yeah, that doesn't sound good to me. Grim snake thing doesn't sound particularly excellent in my opinion. I would actually probably prefer it if there wasn't a grim snake thing that was trying to kill me. Oh God, the planets are so pretty. Oh, uh, where's my dude? Where is my dude? Hey, hey! Hello, my floater pod. I was told in the comments that this, what I did here is actually a terrible idea because these things bug out like crazy. <laughs> so I will keep that in mind and then also foolishly continue to do it. So let's see. So that's stranded near a cave system under attack. Uh, their sea glide is damaged. Let's go this way and just go and explore let's go have some fun it is how do i flashlight again you know what this is fine this is fine let me just get some of this uh do i need creep vine actually probably not oh it's so green hello oh hello hoop fish i've already scanned you i have not the ocean is so cool. Oh, are these jellyfishy doodads? Hello. Drooping stinger. Oh, what is this? What is this? Assessment, avoid. Yeah, no, that's fair, actually. That's 30 fair. Seconds. Uh, 30 seconds? Okay, fine. There's so much cool shit in the ocean. I need to be more mindful. So let's go 215 meters and go and explore all the different things that we now have access to. Hello? Anything of interest? Hello? Anybody at all? Can I, can I do anything with this? No, that's just part of the thing. This is so pretty, guys. Hey. Oh. Whoever was in this pod was not as lucky as I was to have survived. That or they're long gone. I can build a sea moth. Ooh. Ooh, that looks cool. Is there anything I can do to get in here? Let me see. Abandoned PDA. Let's download data. Integrating new PDA data. 30 seconds. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. I can't. I forgot. It doesn't pause when I do that. Okay, we gotta go up. We gotta go up. We gotta go up. I will... Oh, there's more pieces of the Aurora over there that I can check out. Come on. Come on. Ooh. All right, now that we're kind of above water a little bit, let's check this out. Do I get voice acting? Ozzy's log. It's the day of the crash. I don't know what the heck is happening. I'm scared, and I'm not going outside. There are shadows in the water under the... But I can't tell if they're rocks or aliens. Both? There's weird-looking caves nearby. The Aurora was carrying everything needed to build the phase gate. Mobile vehicle bays, bioreactors, propulsion phase cannons. Gate. It had a cinema. There, there was a zero <laughs> G gym. My cafe. I don't understand how we're here now. Oh. I don't know why no one's coming for me. Yikes. Yo, Ozzy. That must have been terrifying. The. Okay, everything's just gonna pop in kind of wacky like. He did mention caves nearby, which means that he might still be hiding out, making like a settlement over there, that maybe he's still alive? Possibly? Is there anything else? I'm not quite sure. Passing Ooh. 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. Hello, you're beautiful. Local scans show a nearby cave entrance. Depth 90 meters, leading to an unknown environmental biome. I would... Okay. 30 seconds. Let me collect this stuff while I'm here. Oh, we can go farther down. 
we can go farther down, but my oxygen is um, being a very big problem. It's going to limit how far down I can go until I can either get something to, yeah, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Until I either get a larger oxygen tank or something that I can use for my explorations that doesn't actually use my oxygen. Maybe like the sea moth. Hello. Ooh, red moss. 30 seconds. Oh man, I thought I thought I would be fine with the new oxygen tank, but there's actually like the farther down I go, which of course obviously it means I'm using more oxygen, but I just didn't expect it to be so deliciously tempting so early, if that makes sense, for me to just like go down farther. I did not bring the extra battery for the sea glide like it was recommended to me in the comments because I am in fact a moron. Well, I could try to explore the cave nearby. I don't know if I have the oxygen for it. It feels, uh, it feels risky. It feels really risky without doing another, um, without increasing the oxygen. What are you? What are you? Hello? Well, aren't you neat? Reef back? Look at how cool it is. 30 seconds. Uh, this is a long scan. Oh my goodness, you're like an eldritch horror. Reef back Leviathan. Oh, I can't read this yet. Wait, Leviathan. Okay, we're above, we're above right now. Come on, go on. Stop it to stabilize without jumping. Reef back Leviathan? This vast life form is in excess of 13 years long and has been designated Leviathan class. Fortunately, it feeds exclusively on plankton life life forms. Um, life cycle assessment harbors plant small fish and metal rich barnacles. Can I? I'm gonna try something. It said metal rich barnacles, right? Can I farm metals off of the top of it? Oh, it looks like I might be able to. It looks like a pearl papyrus. Come on. Is this something I can use? It is something I can acquire. Writhing reed. He doesn't seem too bothered by me like just chilling out here. So maybe this is all cool. He, okay, he's getting a little perturbed. He's getting a little perturbed. Where is the metal though that I wanted? Oh, what the hell are you? Tiger plant. Well, will you quiet yourself down, sir? Will you just quiet down? I'm just having a look-see on top of you. You are a wacky dude. You're super cool though. Oh, this thing is absolutely beautiful. There's actually several of them in the area. Oh, wow, I gotta remember this. So they don't see, some of them don't seem as uh, rich in, uh, rich in little dudes on the top, is that one? I guess they're younger and haven't accumulated them yet. There's another one over here that's rich in it. Maybe I can find a rare metal that I need. Otherwise, I'll probably have to go deep and deep dive down in, but that's okay, just so. Hello? Do you have barnacles for me to break? Good sir? Uh, break barnacle. Silver! Silver! We're good! Oh, baller! It's only one, it's only one that I can find. But that's progress. That is something I did not have before. Excellent. Salt deposits, so special equipment. No, no, we finally found salt. What do I need? What do I need? Titanium, that's fine. My inventory's full anyway. Hello, stingers. Yeah, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here with the sea glide. Uh, probably should craft the battery cell, or at least grab the one that I had before, before this damn thing runs out of power. What, what the hell is attacking me? What, what, what is attacking me? What is, what is accosting me right now? Is this guy? Or was there something else? I don't understand. You know what, bye guys, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go now. 
I actually was not expecting to get wounded to become the big wound. But if you're here, I will take your minerals. This is Avery Quinn. Oh, wait. Ship Sunbeam. I didn't even know Aurora I had a message. Reed. Over. Nothing but vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease. They send an SOS. You offer to help, they don't pick up. <laughs> Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still yes. need our assistance? Very Over. much. No. I'll try them again tomorrow. No. Damn charter's going to have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. No, listen. See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime? Yeah, please pick us up with long range scans because we do, in fact, need help. We, 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 we very much do need help getting off this planet. I would really appreciate it. Um, I don't know what to do with these. You know, let's just go take... I'm going to take a look to the fabricator, see if there's anything of u interest. I need two silver ore for the wiring kit. Ah! Ah! I feel like keeping these seeds is really useful. Like, I feel like keeping these seeds overall will lead to something that I can use that it will be incredibly useful. This is what I need. If I need it for th this, the high-capacity O2 tank. Oh, this is awesome, actually. This is really good. This is really, this is fantastic. Oh, this is, this is, this is everything I ever wanted in life. For now, I'm going to try to keep just one of each seed. I grabbed the multiples, but I imagine that what they're going to be used for are basically for um, growing things. So I'm just going to keep one of each seed. As for these mushrooms, I got to get rid of them. They're taking up way too much space and I can easily acquire them. Okay, here we go. So first, make the standard O2 tank. Easy enough, bingo bongo. Now we use that. We get the high capacity. I probably could have unequipped this the O2 tank I have on. I don't know if there's any benefit to keeping it around. But now, now here we go. Oh my goodness, how much oxygen do I have? 135. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Now what is this guy over here? Rebreather, wiring kit, and fiber mesh. So for that, conserves oxygen when diving deeper. That will let me go even deeper. So that's the resource that I need. And I need silver for it so I can make the wiring mesh, which I believe is two silver, right? The wiring kit, sorry, not mesh. That's gonna get real confusing. I should not have crafted a whole new standard O2 tank. That's probably not the greatest thing I could have done with my resources. I should have just unequipped it. Well, I can just let this sit here, goodbye. Farewell. What I do desperately need is uh, I need some bladder fish because I'm running. I'm running a little low on water. Time to scan more things. I already have a sea glide. Yeah. So, oh, oh, that gets me materials from it though. Okay, cool. Today I learned. Easy source of materials. The myriad of sounds that we have in this game astounds me every time. I'm right over here by my, that that guy right there. That whatever sound that was. The uh, I'm right by my ship, or my escape pod. I have been, I have pretty much explored all this stuff like directly here, maybe not in the cave systems, but I still feel like I hear new sounds every time I go in deep, like deep dive. I desperately need to find a way that I can make filtered water out of ocean water for free. There's gotta be something there, right? Like with all this high tech technology, some sort of auto filter where I can just pull in water from the ocean. It would astound me if there wasn't. Let's go and check out this other signal, and that'll be what we ha what we do with the last bit of this episode. 500 meters away, so it's still a decent chunk away from what our normal route has been. Now let me, did I, have I scan this table coral? Yeah, I, I have. So we might still find some interesting, really cool stuff in the ocean over there. Let's see, we should be getting pretty close, yeah. Are they, are they just like down deep into here? They are. I wonder where they went. Sea glide fragment. I don't need the titanium currently, actually. Hello? Oh, this thing's been beat to shit even more than the other one. Abandoned PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Yeah, let me let me go up and just like listen to their story. Find out maybe a clue on if they survived or where they went. God, I hope some of these people are surviving and building their own bases elsewhere. That's the dream, right? Um, God, I hate surfacing is one really weird me like mechanic in this game. Just normal surfacing is. Here we go. Here we go. Found it finally. You really think it'll carry two of us? 
Your regular sea glide tows a mass of 80 kilograms at over 30 kilometers an hour. The power cell rig to this one should double that. You think there's something out there that's faster? I'm sure. And that's assuming it doesn't overload three meters from the life pod. Oh boy, You're this sounds dangerous. This. I'm seeing the engineering problem. If I stop seeing the mats, I'll be terrified. I tows a mass of 80 kilograms. So, oh, oh, okay, we're just gonna do the that again. I really hope that they are hiding out somewhere off in the distance. This is another piece of the Aurora that just got destroyed. Okay, you look mean, and you're probably gonna fight me, but let's go dip deeper down. Is there anything down here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go eat a rock. Salt. Yeah, yeah, that's salt. Okay. I need to know what I gotta do to mine that. Maybe I should take a closer look at my blueprints and everything? I'm not sure. Meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah, I know oxygen efficiency and all that jazz, but there's stuff. Salt deposit? Okay, we don't need anything too crazy to do that. So if I can find a cave system, that's probably where I'm gonna start finding some proper silver. Maybe right over here. Hello, drooping stinger. No, this isn't a proper cave system, is it? There are creature eggs. I don't know what to do with the creature eggs right now, so I'm leaving them be, even though I imagine I can have cool little pet dudes that hopefully don't want to eat my face. That's the dream, at least. I mean, but then again, if your pet doesn't want to eat your face, are you really living? Laser cutter fragment? Here we go. That's probably what I need to break up the uh, bigger deposits. So if I can find more of this, yeah. One more after this. Then we can actually make some proper progress. Okay. It's all coming together. Bioreactor, I'll take it. Radiation detected. Lovely, lovely. Like, how detected are we talking? Like, I should get out of here detected or you're, you'll be good for a little bit before you realize you can't have kids detected. I'm definitely braving the radiation right now to get some scans. Yeah, we have a CMOS scan. Bio... We're gonna have bioreactor. Okay, whoa. Oh, you're the suckers that were attacking me last time when I was chilling out over somewhere else. I'm going to leave now because you're flinging some shit at me and I don't want to deal with that. Laser cutter fragment. That's all I need. That's all that's left that I need from you. Okay, let's get away from the radiation, because I'm actually taking that hot damagio, you know what I mean? Uh, let me actually medkit up. You're gonna spit more fire at me. The deeper I go here... God, there's still more radiation. I thought I was going away from it, but apparently not. Oh, there's a giant rock area over here. What can I explore over here? Can I actually get on land? I mean, I doubt it, but it might have cave systems underneath, which is kind of what I'm hoping for. Anything of interest over here? Any way in, or can I just use this, like, as a general mining area? Sandstone? Lead! Lead, 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 lead! Lead, lead, lead! Oh! We're good! A completely different resource! I'm gonna have a radiation suit soon! I think that was actually all the lead I needed! Okay! Any giant, suspicious rock I ever find? Easy enough, go explore it. Limestone, I already know it comes out of that. I need more of that sandstone. Salt deposit, that's fine. More salt is also good. Okay, even better. Silver ore as well. Yes, this is perfect. Mobile vehicle bay fragment, sure. Making so much progress right now. So much progress, getting silver, getting lead. I'm gonna spend a little bit of time here firing stuff up and then we'll go back to base. Wait, what was that? What was that last one that I got? Was that silver? No, gold! Oh, we got that gold! We can start making jewelry, hell yes. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. Interesting. Would you like to tell me where that energy signature is coming from? Huh, but like I was going to say, my top priority when I'm stranded in water world is uh, making some nice golden jewelry. Not survival, not making livable water, not rebuilding civilization, 
having that hot, hot jewelry. I wonder if the energy signal is coming from the depths down below over here. Shale outcrop, that's even more new. And the go and gold is a regular drop from shale? Or maybe I just got really lucky there and it's actually a rare drop, but I didn't get that impression. What else? What other secrets do you hide? Oh, mountain of greatness. Everyone, this mountain is a lifesaver. Absolutely. Diamond! What? But how about no? Your current bill stands at three million credits. But like, how about if I didn't? Instead, I bet you Diamond can do all kinds of stuff. I'm on land? I'm on, I'm on land. Also, computer, really uncool to not mention that until I find literal diamond. Goddamn corporate shill. Okay, so there's huge deposits of materials on this, uh, on this island. Oh my God. It's so weird to be, yo, 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 Krabby, Krabby. Oh no, 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 Krabby angry, Krabby angry, Krabby angry. Huh. Stop that. Stop that. You're not for me. Sorry. Sorry, Krabby. I do not choose you. Bulbo tree? A Bulbo Baggins tree? Wait, edible high water content. <gasps> okay, I will take that seed for sure. Because if I can use that, oh my goodness, look at the way that... <coughs> oh, the fucking main man, no, 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 Okay, you want to fight me, do you, Krabbies? You want to fight me? I'm running now, actually. I'm going to just run. That's what I'm going to do. Guys, this was supposed to be a quick little trip, and then I run back to the ship. That was the plan. This is going to be a short episode. This, 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 ow? What the fuck was that? This is going to be a short episode. Hello? Anybody of interest in here? Whoa, look at this stuff down here. There's so much cool stuff. Okay, you know what? Back to the surface, back to the island. Oh, at least I can see the crappies in the night. Hey, hey you, can you not attack me every two seconds? I would really appreciate it. I'm just looking for materials, Krabby. Lithium? Ooh, can I make lithium batteries? Is that a thing? Is that a thing? Look at all this diamond and gold. I'm rich, inventory full. What do I, what can I get rid of? Titanium, diamond dozen. Let me get everything cool here. No, oh God, creepy, I'm leaving now. This island has many horrors in the shape of weird crabs. You monster, you monster bastard. Okay. It's probably more terrifying than they are dangerous, but that's fine. It's fine. What the fuck? Oh! Is that another civilization's? What in the world? Uh, uh, is this not of interest to your scanning? This alien technology? Is this not something that you, you're intrigued by, Scanner? Hello? Force field control? Data downloads. This device matches no known technologies and it's likely alien nature. Power is being routed via terminal to the nearby force field. This technology is far beyond anything encountered beyond, before by the Federation. We discovered new alien tech on this planet? Okay, I need a key for it then. I don't have the tablet. We found alien technology. What? What also, you are broken. But can I recreate you by scanning? This carbon-based device is lighter than it looks and features a symbol which resembles a U lit in purple. Despite onboard power still functioning, algae growth on the exterior indicates it was banned hundreds, perhaps thousands of years ago. While the technology is far beyond Federation levels, there is no obvious way to interface with it. It should no never nonetheless be possible to fabricate a precise physical copy of the device if necessary. So we can make these keys. Is there a way I can mark this on the map or on a map or something? Or like, I don't know. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. This island has produced results.
Okay, it is a long trip back. I need to go all the way back to base. Nighttime is super spooky, guys. Nighttime in the ocean is absolutely terrifying. I am so scared that anything could come out and chop my balls at any moment in time. It's really weird that I can't see that rock in the distance. I guess just it's the render distance. It's a little bored because I was like, man, I should be able to see that giant rock from far away. Or maybe there is alien cloaking technology to where I can't see it normally. And if that's the case, that would explain why I don't see any land at all. All right, let's go ahead and listen to this message that I left behind before. Aurora, this is Sunbeam again. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. Yeah, you, that I might be me. I didn't know how bad, how many of you, I, I didn't know. We're now Fair. en route to your location. We're going to bring you home. Sunbeam out. Excellent. There is a rescue what coming. What else can I say? The only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. And I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. What was that? What was that last bit? What was, what was that last bit? I'm a little confused. Maybe I missed some context there? Oh man, guys. Guys, we have made some progress. I'm not going to take the time this episode to sort through all this because who even knows what we have access to now? You know what I mean? Oh my God, fast stealing. I don't know. I don't know what we have access to. There's a whole bunch of stuff, but I am going to head. And also there's this perpetual, okay, the fabricator was bugged to always be loud. So it's nice that that's over with. But let's just go out here. And I really hope this episode didn't turn out as choppy as the last one. I think my computer's having some issues with some of the water effects and recording them. Maybe I should turn it down. I don't know, I don't wanna, look at the water. There's a reason why the water quality is high and it's because the water is beautiful. But we found alien technology. Oh yeah, actually that is one thing I wanna check. Um, it's very important to me. I want to check purple tablet. So that's what the diamond will be used. I need an ion cube, whatever that is. Sure, sounds easy to make, easy, okay. But I'm going to leave this episode of Subnautica here. I like to think we made a lot of progress. We visited two locations. We found tons of materials. We have a way forward. So, yeah. But thank you, everybody, for watching this episode of Subnautica. If you liked this video, hit that like button. I'm not asking. I'm commanding. Hit the like button. Or don't if you don't feel like it. But also leave a comment down below letting me know what you think. Do you have any tips and tricks that are non-spoilery in nature? Uh, is there anything you would like to see me do in particular that hopefully would be non-spoilery in nature? But you know what? I'll leave it up to you for your best discretion with that. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Valiant!